My name is Rayhan Lalui, and I'll be reading an excerpt from my novel, The Rules of Wicker Williams. Mom, this is not for me. This is for people who lived how I lived. This is for the people who still can't believe how they're living. This is for the people who are going to live how I lived. This is not for you, but this is to you. Addiction is lawless, but I gave it a constitution. I won't keep it hidden if others might read it and hear their own voices. This was our life, but these are my rules. Always your son, Wicker. Rule one, don't ask store clerks if they've got what you're looking for in the back, because they don't. I'm five years old, and it never once occurs to me that our family isn't normal. Everyone has a mother who comes home at 3 a.m. so loud that some nights we only get five or so hours of sleep. You rarely remember to make me breakfast, so I just take a yogurt in the morning and occasionally remind you to buy another box. You're supposed to meet my teacher for kindergarten conferences, but you forget. I tell her you are sick. You are, but not with a cold. My teacher, Miss Jules, is more annoyed that she has to reschedule your appointment to after school hours than she is concerned that all I have for lunch most days is an assortment of stale cheese crackers and a juice box. One day, after class, when you're late to pick me up, Again, I ask Miss Jules if she has any extra snacks left. She says no. Sometimes, when we're in the store with lots of bottles in it, I hear you asking the guy at the front if he's got any of what you're looking for in the back. So I ask Miss Jules if she's got any more food in the back. She looks at me funny and says no again. I'm not allowed to invite my friends over to play because the apartment is never ready for them. One day, when I do organize a play date all on my own, I notice that my friend Nigel's mom looks around funny. Nigel doesn't stay long. You get upset and tell me that I'm not allowed to play with Nigel anymore. It's okay. The next day, Nigel tells me his mom says he's not allowed to play with me anymore. I don't understand what happened, but you do. It's only the start. <laughs>